So first thing we're gonna do is, we wanna get the weight into a 360. But before we do that, we wanna understand how the weight is gonna move, distribution. So from here, we're going to metronome the bell from side to side, 10 to two. She has a shorter grip on the weight because the, the weight, as it's further away from your hand, the heavier the weight is gonna be. So first we're gonna go 10 and two, which is right outside our shoulder. And that's where you want the bell of the mace to travel. You don't want the weight to go directly behind you as you get into a 360. So you're gonna come back to ready position. From here, we're just gonna turn around and put the weight behind us so you can see how the weight travels as it goes into a 360. So we're just gonna turn around. We're gonna put the, we're gonna dump the weight, which is naturally putting the weight to the side, and then we're gonna pendulum the weight. So her elbows are high, she's back in her lats, and the weight is swinging through the motion of her forearm and hand grip. Soft knees. Stable body so that the weight isn't dragging her and we're just controlling the weight, the weight of the mace. Back and forth, pendulum. So pull that back over into front and we're gonna turn around, gonna spin. Right now what we're gonna do is a 10 and two swing. The weight of the bell is gonna be behind her. She's not gonna let it drop all the way. It's just gonna come halfway and then pull back with her lats. 10 and two. Nice. Gonna come back to neutral position now. 